hey guys welcome to Zom's kitchen so if you want to learn how i make that sumptuous rice just keep watching guys kindly check the description box for the list of all the ingredients that was used here is all of them we have our chopped spring onion we have our purple cabbage our minced carrot our boiled rice we have our oil our pinky valley and salt we have our crushed um, chili pepper we have our um, garlic we have our chicken stock this is our soy sauce the light soy sauce and the dark soy sauce and we also have a sesame seed oil now guys let's get into it now in your wok add some vegetable oil together with your sesame seed oil allow it to heat up a bit this sesame seed oil is everything then you add your light soy sauce and your dark soy sauce allow it to cook for a bit kindly turn down your heat before adding the soy sauce then to that add your minced onion and spring onion now to this add your minced carrots and allow it to cook for just a few it doesn't have to cook for too long because it is minced if it's chopped you might allow it to cook for a bit longer please don't let the vegetables be soggy nah now to this you can now add all your oops <laughs> okay now to this i just added my garlic allow it to cook for a bit now this is properly cooked so i'll be adding my rice and i'll be giving this a very good stir for an even look you don't want one part of your rice to look white and the other parts looking really good and brown you want everything to be the same color it is also important to know that the amount of soy sauce you use affects your rice if you use so much your rice will literally be black <laughs> and you don't want to eat black rice do you also the amount of oil you use is so important if you use so much your rice gets bad in a matter of hours now add your chicken seasoning and your crushed chili pepper the amount you use is really up to you add a little bit of salt please don't add so much salt because the soy sauce has a large quantity of salt in it already give this a good stir a very good stir and let it cook for a bit and now to my favorite part we'll be adding our pop cabbage you guys know i love my cabbage i love my purple cabbage i love everything vegetable i mean <laughs> now give this a good stir please do not let it cook for long so it doesn't get soggy you want your vegetables still very alive and a bit crunchy add your chopped spring onion and more and more and a bit more <laughs> and give this a good stir guys let it cook for a bit at this point you can actually turn off your heat because there's already a lot of heat fluff this out so that some heat will go off and our delicious rice is ready add your chicken and serve guys if at this point you've not subscribed to Ozum's kitchen let me ask you what really are you waiting for please hit the subscribe button just by the side so join the Ozum's kitchen family guys like our videos and comment we absolutely love to hear from you back to the rice if you wouldn't finish the consumption of this rice within two hours please and please guys store in the fridge do not leave it on the tabletop it will get bad in a matter of hours now let me have a taste of my sumptuous meal guys just look how this looks so beautiful when I say this rice is sumptuous, I did not miss words. I mean every bit of it. This rice is sumptuous, guys. Give it a try. Cook it on Sunday. Give your loved ones, your family, your friends, anyone there to your heart this sumptuous meal. And watch them glow with joy. I mean it, guys. Give it a try. And until next time, see you and thank you for watching.